Hello, Amy. This is Paul from Kachina in Kohler, Wisconsin. Um, today we are going to be preparing our polo piccata for you. It is on our light side of the menu here at Kachina at lunchtime. Um, we have a few dishes that are under 250 calories and 150 milligrams of sodium, and this is one of the dishes that we have for you today. To start off, we have a lean chicken breast. Uh, we took as much fat off as possible. Basically what we're going to do to make it piccata is basically just give it a little pound, pound it out. By pounding it out, it basically takes less uh, fat, so whether it's butter, olive oil, um, to basically cook it. So keeping with the healthiness, uh, we're going to pound it out so it cooks quickly and we don't have to use a whole lot of oil in it. Once your chicken is pounded, we're going to use a little bit of light spray on it and a house-made uh, seasoning that we use with all of our, all of our proteins, whether it's our, our fish, our chicken, our pork. Um, we make house-made spice rub that we put on all of it. So we're just going to sprinkle just a little bit of that onto our chicken. And then basically get that on our wood-fired grill and get that cooking. And to the pan, we're going to add a little bit of vegetable oil and a little bit of fresh chopped garlic. You just want to start to sweat the garlic down. Get the flavors out of it, uh, not burning it. Uh, burnt garlic is bitter, and that's definitely not what we're looking for. Once we get a nice little saute on that, we're just going to add a little bit of white wine to it. Burn off the alcohol. As you can see, our chicken over here is ready to flip. That's perfect. And then to the pan, we're going to add a little bit of broccoli and cauliflower. I just quickly blanched off ahead of time. A little bit of zucchini and squash and just a pinch of salt and a good amount of pepper. Just saute until the vegetables almost start to sweat down. Once they're about halfway done, we're going to add a few of the cherry tomatoes. Definitely in springtime, summer, heirloom tomatoes are coming in. Um, if you can find those, those are definitely great to use in this dish. Any vegetables are really fine here, whatever you have hanging out um, in your house uh, would work great in this dish. Once it's sweated down, we're going to add lemon juice to it. And basically the white wine and the lemon juice that we added to this is going to be the sauce for our dish. Uh, like I said, since this is under 250 calories, uh, there's absolutely no butter in the dish. So white wine and lemon juice is a great alternative to healthy, healthy cooking. As you can see here, our chicken is nicely grilled. Didn't take very long at all since we pounded it out. We're going to put that right into right into the liquid and the vegetables. Since it is a polo piccata, we're going to add just a little bit of spaghetti pasta to it. Not a whole lot. I have maybe about an ounce here of spaghetti. And since the spaghetti was cooked off ahead of time, if you had a big meal last night, you know, spaghetti and meatballs at your house, you have a little bit of spaghetti just hanging out, looking for something to do with it, you know, this is a great dish to use it up in. And by all means, if you're not worried about calories, add butter to the dish, um, add more pasta to the dish, it's really up to you on what you like. All right, as far as plating goes, our dish is done. Take our beautiful chicken breast there, place it right down in the bottom of your bowl. Take your pasta and vegetables, 
scatter them around. Make sure you get the sauce in there as well. And like I said, since it was a healthy option on our menu, there will be no cheese on top of it. Um, just a little bit of fresh parsley again, tarragon, chive, any of that would be perfect on top. And that is Kachina's Polo Piccato.